Hi friends. How are you? Shell doubling can be done, horizontally, or vertically. Doubling shells less than 2.5 meters long, vertically is easier than horizontal doubling. In this video, I will show you how to double two shells vertically and in the correct method. Let us prepare the shells for doubling. Install one or two spider supports in the shells. Divide the shell circumference into four equal parts. Mark the vertical weld joint rotation on both shells. Mark the outer diameter on a plate or a platform. Put minimum eight numbers of elevators on the circle as shown. Usually, I use 100 mm high elevators. But, if you use a 400 mm elevator, you can enter inside the shell easily. Tack weld the elevators with the plate. Transfer the circle on the elevator. Tack weld C's on the elevator, minimum 10 mm away from the circle. Put one shell on the elevator. Make sure the shell is exactly on the circle. If required, drive wedges through the slots on the cleats to maintain the roundness of the shell. Tack weld these brackets inside and outside the shell at least at four locations, 90 degree apart. This will stop the top shell from falling down. Put the top shell on top of the first shell. Most important thing. Check the vertical weld line degrees in the drawing and mark these lines carefully. Put 3 mm thick spacers between the joint to maintain the gap and the shell overlap. Use this U-bracket to manage the overlap, wherever necessary. Avoid unwanted tack welds on the shell. Try to use the same shell grade material for making tools. If the overlap and the root gap are under the tolerance, tack weld in the joint. Thank you for watching. Good day.